Hi friends, now we will see about Docker. What is Docker? Docker is an open source platform for developers and system admin to build and ship and run distributed application anywhere. Docker we can run on popular 64 bit Linux and distribution with the kernel version 3.8 or later. Docker supported by several cloud platforms including Amazon EC2, Google Compute Engine, and Rackspace. Now we will see features. Docker is lightweight, minimal overhead. Docker is based on the Linux containers. One more feature like portable. Docker can run on any Linux system that support LXC. Possible feature support for other operating system Solaris, OSX, Queen, Windows per feature. Docker is self-sufficient which means your docker container should be able to run anywhere that docker can run. This is the challenge which we are the current application we are getting. Okay, You can figure out this sample uh, picture from this uh, PPT presentation. Okay. As I said earlier docker is a container system for code. Like you can see here, this is the container. Within the container, development VM available, QA server available, customer center, data center, public cloud, everything contained. Okay. Docker architecture, Docker engine. So in the, in the Docker engine, common line interface will be there. Docker daemon process will be running. Docker registry also will be running. Docker hub, Docker hub is a cloud service. So we can share our applications, automate workflows in the Docker app, assemble apps from components, Docker images, then we need to know Docker containers. Docker containers, it's a unit of software delivery. So in the container we can ship anywhere. I mean, we can ship and run everywhere. Run everything, I mean anything, anywhere. So once the container ready with the docker, so what is the process to run the docker means? Simply we have to press the button, the button, once you press the button, the automatic process will be happen, no? So similar to the container with the docker. So the application automatically installed, configured. No need to do any manual configuration with the docker. How does docker work? You can build docker images that hold your applications. You can create docker containers from those docker images to run your applications. You can share those docker images via docker hub or your own registry. So docker container life cycles. So the life cycle of docker container we can see now. The consumption which means the build. The build an image from docker file. From the docker file we can able to build our docker image. Okay, the run which means create and start the container means the run command they have to use. The reproduction which means we can commit, we can commit a container to a image or we can uh, run a new container from an image. To want, uh, if you want to kill or sleep the container means kill command will be there. To start the command, I mean to start the stopped container means start command available. To remove the stopped container or am command available. RMA is here to delete your container image, docker container image. Docker file, it's a hot of docker, okay. Like a make file, it's a SL script with the keywords. The docker file extends from your base image. The docker file results in a new docker image. Okay, a docker file lists the steps needed to build an image. Docker build is used to run a docker file. Can define a default command for docker run ports to expose. Here you can see some sample docker file from base image Ubuntu base image. Run apt get update. We are doing update process. Then run apt get install uh, iPhone Y and Python software properties we are going to install. Then some configuration. This is the automatic process. Okay. 
docker some commands you can find it from this sheet uh, from this sheet uh, you can you can use it there are a lot of docker commands attach build commit copy diff so these are the docker commands you can see here in this in this slide okay you can follow it so now we will go to the summary so docker is uh, docker is easy to build and run and share the containers Docker is rapidly expanding the ecosystem. Docker is a better performance versus virtual machines. Docker is a layered file system. Gives us Git-like control of images. Reduces the complexity of the system build. The Red Hat project atomic host and certifications. Containerized applications cured or open shipped. Google is expected to tightly integrate containers with its IaaS. Okay, IaaS, we can call it as IaaS and PaaS. PaaS means platform, applications, a service offerings. Okay, so this is the way uh, we can follow the Docker. Uh, Docker is especially distributed application. We can build, ship, and run anywhere. Okay, Docker is similar to version control like well, version control system like Git. Okay, so thanks. Thanks for watching this video. Uh, please click subscribe. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video.